What's good with my ninjas? Anime analyst here, and before I get into this video, I just wanted to notify you that Naruto Storm Force fourth official trailer from the Japanese Expo 2015 has been released. You can click anywhere on the annotations in this video to see it. It features Kaguya, Mike Guy versus Madara boss battle, uh, Madara Jinchuriki combos, all that good stuff. Just click anywhere in the annotations to see it. And with that, we also got some new info about the actual variations of the games like collector's edition pre-order bonuses stuff like that was also included in trailers so with that i'm gonna go ahead and break down the collector's edition and the pre-order bonuses and stuff like that all right so if you pre-order this game right off the bat the game comes out in autumn 2015 now autumn officially starts september 23rd so when you're thinking about the release date it's not coming before september 23rd so just think september 23rd forward so autumn 2015 you pre-order the game you get some early access content and then you get some exclusive content let's go over the early access content so with the early access content you get two playable characters naruto the last and sasuke the last in addition to that it also comes with a team ultimate jutsu for the both of them so you pick them on the same team you get the team ultimate jutsu the next early access items you will get are sakura the last and hinata the last costumes so they're not characters sakura and hinata are only costumes from the last movie so i mean it's meh but i'm mean, at the same time i actually don't even like those designs better than the regular ones so i mean if it's for you it's for you okay so let's go over the exclusive content now when you pre-order the game so when you pre-order the game you get a kakashi hokage skin which is his form from the last because kakashi is hokage in naruto the last movie so you get the skin he's not a character you get the kakashi the last hokage skin with the jacket looks pretty cool and then some big 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 things you really run a pre-order the game just because of this you get this is exclusive for pre-orders free pre pre-orderers you get boruto uchi I said Boruto Uchiha, Boruto Uzumaki and Sarada Uchiha as playable characters as well as a combination Ogi for the two of them. So these are their forms from the new upcoming movie Boruto, Naruto the movie. So you get Boruto and Sarada as playable characters from just pre-ordering the game. Now we don't know if they'll be available in the future so you better up and pre-order this game even if it's one week before release you better get that pre-order in if you want to be uh playing the game with boruto and sourda okay so now let's go on to the collector's edition all right so the collector's edition for this game of course ps4 and xbox one you get the full game uh there doesn't seem to be a steam variation of the collector's edition so i'm assuming yep it's going to be for ps4 and xbox one so with this you get the full game of course you get a storm memories art book so i don't know if it's like uh i don't know if it's in black and white or in color the picture on the case is in black and white so it might be like some storm uh exclusive photos artwork that you get so it's in a little booklet it looks all nice you get a naruto uzumaki the last exclusive figurine with the collector's edition the little line says 17 centimeters on it so i mean that's the size of it i'm not really a figurine guy but if that's for you go ahead and grab it up you get the collector's edition box this box is this box is huge for just having this little stuff but you get the collector's edition box which has storm 4 on the middle and then it has naruto on one side of the box and probably sasuke on the other and then you get a metal plate exclusive illustration work in progress visual so it's not really the final image but you get a metal plate with some sort of artwork i don't know if the artwork's inside the metal plate or not i don't know if it's inside the metal i don't I think it's like interchangeable artwork or something like that and it says future pack i'm not really sure what that means i don't know if it's if that's talking about the same thing as the metal plate but yeah so basically you get the full game you get a storm memories art book you get the naruto the last exclusive figurine you get the giant ass box that looks beast as fuck and then you get the metal plate and all the jazz that comes with the metal plate art type shit so in total you're getting one two three four five six you're getting six things 
it seems to be marked for Europeans only right now because it has like the Peggy on it and that's a, a European rating system so I mean I wouldn't be surprised if they left Americans out of the collector's edition like they always do I don't really see why they do that like I really I live in America I really want this this collector I would just buy this to support the game even if I didn't want everything in it but if you're only giving it to European audiences I mean it's nothing I can do so yep that is basically what comes in the collector's edition and all the pre-order bonuses with the game so if you're interested please pre-order the game just please pre-order the game all right thank you guys for watching please leave this like on this video if you enjoyed this information subscribe if you haven't for more Naruto content and I'll see you guys later peace